Hello, Xander. My name is Dr. Zafar. My name is Mr. One, two, three, four, five. Can you proceed? Thank you so much. As you, I have taken all the use of precautionary measures. Hello. Hello. Are you Andrew? Can you hear me? As the patient is not responding to me, I will confirm his name is wristband. It's Andrew, 30 years old. Andrew, can you hear me? Andrew, can you hear me? The patient is not responding. I am going to give him stimulus. Andrew, can you hear me? Andrew, can you hear me? The patient is not responding. I am worried about his airway. He is not talking to me. So I am going to do heart tilt lift maneuver. Make his airway patent. Is my patient airway patent now? No. As the patient airway is still not patent, I am going to give my patient all finger airway. As he is conscious, is my patient airway patent now? No. As my patient airway is still not patent, I would like to call for help the anesthetic team. They will come and secure his airway. Is the patient airway patent now? Yes. As the patient airway is patent now, I will go and look at the monitor. So, if the situation is uh, normal, okay. So, now I am going to start ABCD approach. After airway, I am going to move towards the chest examination. Alright, everything is normal. Alright. So I'm going to feel trachea, trachea is central. I'm going to check the chest expansion. It's normal as well. I'm going to tap on the chest. It's normal as well. Okay, alright. So now I'm going to listen to my patient's breath sounds. The patient breath sounds are normal as well. Alright, so I would like to order portable chest x ray and ABGs. Okay, now I'm going to pinch my patient's finger. One, two, three, four, five is normal. I'm going to check the pulse, it's regular. Alright, heart is normal. I'm going to check my patient's blood pressure. Blood pressure seems normal as well. I'm going to listen to my patient's heart sounds. I would like to order probably DCG as well. I am going to insert large body cannula in the patient's vein and I would also like to send routine blood investigations, CBC, infection markers, infection markers. Alright, so now I am going to check temperature. Okay, temperature is fine. I am going to go to my patient. Pupils, equally reactive light. I'm going to check my patient's blood sugar levels. 1.8. As my patient's blood sugar levels are on the lower side, I'm going to give my patient two ampules of thiamine and some cyanamide for the straws. And give my patient thiamine, he might be alcoholic and not so, so that's why I'm giving thiamine as well. Okay, alright, so now I'm, uh, as my patient is. Uh, not responsive, uh, he's unconscious on ABU scale. So I'm going to now examine his tummy. Okay, this seems fine. I'm going to examine his private area. It's fine. I'm going to look at his legs. It's fine as well. Alright, as you 15 minutes have been passed, I'm going to examine the patient check blood sugar levels again. 2.4 Alright, as the patient brush will have the seal on the large side, I am going to give my patient another bolus of dextrose, 75 ml, 20% Alright Hello Andrew, you are at hospital, I am Dr. Zafar, I am taking care of you Oh, okay, okay doctor, what happened to me? Uh, uh, so Andrew, you are unconscious. So ambulance brought you here, all right? So I have assessed you, and your blood sugar level was on the lower side. So we have given you some dextrose, and I'm glad that you are fine now. You are conscious now, and blood sugar levels are also coming back normal as well. Uh, okay. All right, doctor. Can you please tell me what happened? Doctor, I just felt unconscious in the morning, doctor. All right. Is there anything special happened before it happened? Doctor, I just took insulin and I missed my meal. 
Oh, all right. So you are taking insulin for your diabetes? Y yes, doctor. So for how long you have been diagnosed with diabetes? It's been five years now, doctor. Right. So do you take your insulin regularly? Yes, doctor. I do take. All right. Okay. And is there anything uh, other than this happened before it started? Uh, no, doctor. By any chance, any heart racing, any sweating? Yes, doctor. I was having those symptoms as well. Alright, other than diabetes, any other medical condition you have been diagnosed with? Uh, no doctor. Okay, alright, alright. Uh, so, and by any chance, do you drink alcohol? Yes doctor, I do so. How often? Last night, I had alcohol as well. And uh, like, how much alcohol? Doctor, it was around 1 to 1.5 bottles. Alright, and what type of alcohol? Mm, it was fine, doctor. Okay, all right, all right. So, uh, thank you so much, Andrew, for being with me so far. So, from the history you have given me an examination, uh, I am suspecting that you have something called hypoglycemia. Oh, all right, all right, doctor. It is basically a condition in which the level of sugar in your blood decreases. Oh, okay. You told me that you have taken insulin, you skip your meal, and you have also taken. And lots of alcohol as well, both of these can lead to this condition. Oh, Alright, doctor. Alright, so I have given you some dextrose and glad you are feeling better. Are you able to take orally? Yes, doctor. Alright, I will give you some biscuits and juice as well. Alright? Okay, okay, doctor. So, uh, now my recommendation is to keep you here. We'll keep assessing you. We might be giving you some fluids as well. Alright? All right, doctor. So when you will be stable and able to go home, I will come and talk to you as well, discussing the trigger factors. All right, and also I will be referring you to diabetic clinic as well. Oh, okay, doctor. By any chance, have you ever thought of quitting the alcohol? No, no, not yet, doctor. Okay, all right. If any time if you change your mind, please let us know. We're here to help you. All right. Oh, okay, doctor. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you. So I have basically managed a patient who presented with unconsciousness or he was un unresponsive so uh, first of all I have maintained his airway alright so after that on checking the blood sugar level it was a lower size so I have given him two boluses of dextrose and also thiamine as well I have given him thiamine because he was alcoholic as well alright so to, pre to prevent burning and cuffalopathy I need to give Time in as well. Alright, so this is all from the hypoglycemia. Thank you so much.